Hey guys, welcome back to Firefly. This is episode five. It's called Safe. I'm running out of brown things. This dress does have some brown flowers on it though. It's way too hot in Australia to wear a brown coat, unfortunately. So flowery brown things will have to suffice for the time being. Guys, I love this show so much. I am already sad that it's ending so soon. I will definitely have to watch it all over again one day. I just love it. It's so funny. The characters are incredible and I'm having the best time watching. Cannot wait to get started with this one. So let's go. You got a job, we can do it. Don't much care what it is. <laughs> I love the intro. Wow, that house is gorgeous. Oh, Tam Estate. This is Simon and River. That's wrong. It's from the book, River. No, the book is wrong. This whole conclusion is fallacious. Oh, she is so amazing. You will repay me by becoming a brilliant doctor. Dedicated source box, brilliant doctor. <laughs> it's okay. It's not it's okay. okay. Be shoved 20 needles in my eyes and ask me what I see. No test today. No running test. Stupid son of a bitch dressed me up like a Goram doll. No tests, no shots. Ever. So she's added cussing and the hurling of outer things to her repertoire. We're two miles above ground and they can probably hear her down there. Human body can be drained of blood in 8.6 seconds given adequate vacuuming systems. Morbid and creepifying, I got no problem with. Long as she does a quiet like, gag her if you have to. Wow, that's the most forceful I have seen, Mal. His priority right now is definitely with his trade of the cattle. Fancy vessels such as that don't land here unless they got something to sell. Oh no, that scene with River, I feel so bad for her. I have not seen her that bad. She normally is quite a little bit up and down with her moods, but that's probably the worst that I have seen her. Oh! <laughs> About time you broke in them British shoes. Get out, get along. They walk just as easy if you lead them. I like smacking them. <laughs> Shepherds are purely figurative title, you know. <laughs> eat, sleep, eat. Sounds good. They weren't cows inside. They were waiting to be, but they forgot. Now they see sky and they remember what they are. Is it bad that what she said makes perfect sense to me? I love that. Why don't you take your sister for a little walk? Someplace away. Alliance has us marked as fugitives. Closest alliance is the cruiser Magellan, hours out from here, and I promise you, they ain't coming to a backwater like Janya. Not sure it's such a wise suggestion. Might not want to mistake it for a suggestion. Ooh. We won't leave without you. <laughs> he is rather forceful in this episode. Do you think this would make a nice gift? Is it for Simon? For Simon? Oh. I didn't say that. Mm. <laughs> That's just so spy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you just want to take a bite out of him all over, you know? Uh oh. <gasps> Morning, Ooh. you two. Be careful with that. That's, um. What is that? <laughs> That's a post holer. You dig holes for posts. <laughs> it's, uh, it's dirty and sharp. Good God. They're asking money for this crap. <gasps> Hard to believe, ain't it? <laughs> Glad you're out. Give you a chance to have a little fun. It's fun to get to live on a piece of lasso wreck and eat molded protein and be bullied around by our Pian Jiao Cha Ren of a captain. Oh, it's fun. Okay, lasso serenity ain't lasso. I, I didn't mean. Yeah, you did. You meant everything you just said. Actually, I was being ironic in the strictest sense. You were I didn't being mean. You don't be mean to serenity. And if that's what you think of this life, then you can't think much of them that choose it. Can you? Wow, that is so sad for Kaylee. It's quite a revelation. It's probably just as well she's realized that about Simon River now. It ain't well fed. Scrawny. Milk and hay, three times a day. 20 ahead. That's an amusing figure. In light of you already agreed on 30 with Badger. About a minute from now, we'll agree on 25. <laughs> oh, River. Simon, this is not good. Hang on, they're um, officers. Are they Alliance? Morning, officers. No, they wouldn't be. They wouldn't be. They would recognize him. He's a wanted fugitive. You can go to 25. <laughs> 25. You're taking a loss, but you seem like clean and virtuous boys. <laughs> Done. <laughs> he called it. 
Marcus and Nathaniel Crane. Oh, you are both wanted oh, in connection no. to the illegal killing of Rance Durbin. You know, I'm starting to find this whole planet very uninviting. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's watching the dancing. That is so beautiful. <laughs> Actually, it's so beautiful to see her just being so happy and free. And <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna cry. Is your beef? No, sir. Mm -hmm. You're looking at the proper owners right there. Oh. <laughs> I'd like to see some paper on that cattle. <laughs> oh no! Here we go. <laughs> never go smooth. How come it never goes smooth? <laughs> oh, I love that she's so happy. <laughs> the difference in both scenes is so funny. Oh, it's amazing. <gasps> what? Oh my god. Oh my god? What? Hey, stay with me, Shepard. Oh no. That's, that's quite a lot of blood, isn't it? Afraid I might be needing a preacher. That's good. You can lie there and be ironical. Oh no. Oh god. Shepard, can you hear me? Oh, God. He ain't breathing. He ain't dead, but he's bad off. Now we gotta see what we can do to help him. But you don't understand. My sister. Oh, Found you. Oh, no. Nana, River, run. Go, go. Oh, no. this is so bad. No. He wasn't in town. Wasn't anywhere. He was in town. We saw him there. Him and River. I can show you. Town's not that big, Kaylee. Looks like maybe they got snatched. Kidnapped? Settlers up on the hills take people sometimes. And now they got themselves a doctor. <laughs> yes, they do. Just when we need a doctor. What are you doing? What about Simon and River? Forget them. We already lost two people today. If Hang I can on, help them, what was the third? Wash, get us in the air. I can't believe he's just going to leave. Once the captain realizes what happened, they'll come. Oh, no. No one's coming for you. You just keep moving. I don't believe. No, no, no. He has some sort of plan. There's no way he would just leave. You know where you can find what you need. We're calling inviting you onto the bridge. You didn't. Mal, you know where you can find a doctor. You know exactly. I'm talking about medical facilities. That's not an option. It doesn't matter what you want. He's dying. So the medical facilities are Alliance run, I believe. Oh, got. And he won't go. Sell the they brought home a doctor. Thank the Lord. I feel so torn because these people, I think, genuinely need a doctor. Dear diary, day I was pompous and my sister was crazy. Today we were kidnapped by a hill folk, never to be seen again. It was the best day ever. <laughs> James! <Okay. laughs> He's just going through his thing, seeing what he can keep. He did this for me once. Captain will come up with a plan. Well, that's good. Possibly you're not recalling some of his previous plans. <laughs> left them back there don't seem right you sure this is where you want to be oh i'm fairly certain it ain't uh, yep i got your doctor praise the lord maybe they can make a, Has there been a safe life here bring me light and any supplies you have he's gonna do it i feel that this could be a positive place for simon and river yes i would love to see him back with mal and serenity however he doesn't really have any particular emotional ties or bond to them there's no real pressing need for him to stay with them does that make sense so if he can stay here on this planet and Mal did mention, I think, that Alliance is not generally found here because it's such a not a very good planet, basically. It's too poor, it's too on the outer ring or something like that. So they might actually be safer than being on Serenity. In this episode, right from the very beginning, Mal has been quite different towards River and Simon. So perhaps Simon will take that on board as well. And he may even come to like being here. I'm quite sure that by the end of the episode, they'll be taken back by Mal. They'll come back and get them. However, I do think that Simon may actually be wondering if he could stay here. You sanguine about the kind of reception we're apt to receive on an Alliance ship? What's sanguine mean? Sanguine. Hopeful. Plus, point of interest. <laughs> it also means bloody. 
That pretty much covers all the options, don't it? Yes. It should be okay. Maybe not. Had an accident this morning. Crewman got hurt. We need medical help. We aren't an emergency facility, Captain. Our services aren't available simply to anyone. Uh, I ident card. What's that? Get this man to the infirmary at once. What is that? What's on that card? Why, why did they suddenly change their mind? She won't get a good conversation out of Ruby, I can tell you that much. It was fine until two years ago when she stopped talking. A place like this might be good for your sister. Quiet, safe, a place where folks take care of each other. Seems like a lovely little community of kidnappers. <laughs> the Lord says judge not. They took us off the street. Mm. Sometimes life takes you places you weren't expecting to go. <laughs> life didn't bring us here, those men did. Yep. <laughs> There is that. Shepard's got some kind of connection with the Alliance? You know what it looks like. Still don't surprise me if he did. It's my whole problem with picking up tourists. <laughs> Never what they claim to be. <laughs> it seems like everyone's got a tail on the tail. That's really interesting. Do you do you think maybe he he may have been former Alliance? River? River's gone. Oh, So's what? the girl. I'll check out back. They're probably just playing. I think she's just playing, having a nice time with her. What, what is that? What's happened? You. Fix them. Oh. <laughs> you have to eat. She seems happy here. Hodgeberries. Do you remember when we found those giant hodgeberry bushes on the Camerson's estate? I took you away from there. I know I did. You gave up everything you had to find me. You gave up everything you had. Everything I have is right here. We won't be here long. Daddy will come and take us home. <sighs> I don't think so. I'll get better. I'm so... Is it better than the Camberson's berries? <laughs> Said they're poison. Oh. <laughs> we believed her. <laughs> you are such a brat. Her sister got killed. Mother got crazy. Killed the sister. Oh. No one's been able to get Ruby to speak even a peep. Ruby doesn't talk. Her voice got scared away. If Ruby didn't talk, how do you know um, they shall be among the people? Oh, no. And you will know them by their crafts. What's this? He, they think she's a witch. What are you talking about? Thou shalt not suffer a witch to live. Oh, no. Carmine. Oh. <laughs> this goes from bad to worse. I won't come for you again. You end up here or get mixed up in something worse. You're on your own. So he's abandoned. He abandoned both Simon and River. The new doctor's sister's a witch. No, oh, River is please. not a witch. She's just a troubled girl. You're in charge ever since the old patron died. That's oh right. no, River, stop. <laughs> you were alone in the room with him. <laughs> oh, he killed the old patron. <laughs> okay, well, they're leaving and they're fine. You're going to be fine, Shepard. Lions patched you up. They let us come, and they let us go. I am a shepherd. Folks like a man of God. You like to tell me what really happened? I surely would. Maybe someday I will. Oh, okay. It's good to be home. Home. <laughs> Life would look to be simpler, us not carrying fugies. Yeah, simpler. Come on, Mal. Come on. He's got to have a change of heart, right? Take my life for hers. The witch must die. No! Get away from her! There's way too many people there. He won't be able to fight them all off, just a singular man. She has done nothing to you! Post holder, digging holes for posts. <laughs> Light it. What? Time to go. Oh, wow. What? Well, look at this! <laughs> Fears the guy here just in the nick of time. What does that make us? Big damn heroes, sir. <laughs> Ain't we just? Y'all got something that belongs to us, and we'd like it back. Y'all see the man hanging out of the spaceship with the really big gun? Was kind of out of our way, and he didn't want to come in the first place. <laughs> Man's looking to kill some folks. Cut her down. The girl is a witch. Yeah, but she's our witch. So cut her the hell down. Oh, he's dumped the stuff back. <laughs> hey, doctor. Glad you're back now on the ship. <laughs> oh, I love it. That was awesome. <laughs>
How's he faring? He's gonna be fine. They took good care of him. Good to know. Why did you come back for us? You're on my crew. Yeah, but you don't even like me. You're on my crew. Why are we still talking about this? <laughs> Jaws and ten. I love that. Don't cry. <laughs> oh, that is a beautiful dinner. Wow. They get so looked after. Oh, that was awesome. Guys, that episode was so good. It had so many fantastic moments. There was just so much jam-packed into this episode. It's difficult to single out just a few things. I really enjoyed the interaction between Simon and Kaylee. I know that Kaylee has a little bit of a crush on Simon, but perhaps that's not going to eventuate to anything now that his true feelings have been revealed. However, I also don't know if what Mal said to Simon is going to change Simon's feelings. Like he didn't really seem to think very highly of serenity or being on the ship or that lifestyle before. But now that he knows that he is on the crew, a valued member and wanted there, maybe that will change his mind. I would like to see Kaylee and Simon together. I'm not sure if that's going to happen in this season, but I, I hope that is something that the writers were going to do or are going to do. We still have a little bit of time. I was hopeful that Simon and River would be able to start a new life there, even though I kind of would have assumed he would get back onto Serenity. But just knowing that there may be a place for Simon and River to settle other than just flying around in the ship on board Mal's with Mal's crew. Do you know what I mean? Does that make sense? I just would like to see them be able to be settled somewhere. The parents, the father indeed, Simon and River's father, did not actually seem to care what was happening to River the, the dad definitely did not want to help Simon in any way by rescuing River. He just seemed to think that it would damage his reputation. It would cost too much money. River is so lucky to have Simon. He gave up so much for her. His studies, his work, his career, his standing in society. He gave everything up to help his sister and to be with his sister. And we saw some beautiful Simon and River moments in this episode. Seeing River so happy and dancing was incredible. And she does have the ability to read minds. We saw something very similar in that episode called Bushwhacked, where River knew that there were ghosts. I don't know if she is psychic, but she certainly does have this ability to know what's happened to someone in their past, which is just incredible. I love this episode. I thought it was great. It was a lot of fun. It was a lot more serious than the previous episode. So this one was definitely a little bit more serious, a little bit more emotional, a bit more darker, but that's great. I'm there for it as well. It still had some funny moments as well, which I always love. Okay, guys, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you again really soon in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.